What's up guys, Holland Ian, OG Fitness. Welcome to the channel. If you're new, consider subscribing. In this video, I'm gonna answer another question. So this question is from Irvin Burton. He got my orange belt at a recreational club that only trains twice a week. I'm now looking at another club that trains three times a week with a bigger emphasis on competition. Which one would you recommend for a guy my age? I'm actually, uh, I started judo when I was 36, I'm 41 now. So I understand what you mean because I recommend it in one of my videos where like OGs, guys were a little bit older, two hard sessions a week. And after that, maybe add a third one uh, a little bit lighter. What would I recommend? Well, it depends what your goal is. Uh, like I'm not sure why you want to change clubs, but you know, there could be many reasons for that. Maybe it's because um, uh, you know you moved, maybe it's more convenient, maybe it's a price thing, maybe you just don't get along with people, maybe just whatever, you know? If the other club is more competitive and you like, you're used to training two times a week, but recreational, give it a try. Try it, see if you like it or not. Now, just because a club offers you offers three classes a week, it doesn't mean you have to go three times a week. You can still go two times a week. You try it out, see if you like it. See if you can handle the training. See if it's a good, if that's what you want. And if that's what you want, then yeah, go, switch over to that club, train three times a week. Now, if three times a week is a little bit too much, drop it down to two. And uh, that's the thing too, you can do three times a week, one week, Next week, you're feeling a bit tired, busy, do two times, then do one time. Important thing is to be consistent. You don't have to work out three times. Of course, the more you do it, the faster you'll get at it, but definitely try it out. If you're gonna choose between the two, at least compare the two first. I know it's kind of like, uh, it, we feel as though a lot of times, like we're at a one club, ah, oh, we don't wanna you know, go through the effort because we're, you know, but if you're, already, if you're already looking at another club, three times a week, maybe because you want to train more, or maybe because you're, you're more competent, you want to see what it is like uh, to compete, or maybe you just want to compete or whatever. Recreational two times a week or more competitive three times a week. Try it out, see if you like it or not. And if you do like it, but it's too much three times a week, nothing is, nobody's forcing you to go three times a week. You could just go twice a week or once a week, or you could just alternate. Like I said, some weeks you go three, some weeks you go one, some weeks you go two, and uh, that's fine too. Competitive just means sometimes that they're a little bit more, um, they're a little bit less technical, right? In the sense that they're not showing you uh, the classic, um, like the techniques you need to learn for, uh, you know, uh, yellow, orange, all the color belts, uh, then, green, blue, brown, you know, like you'll learn that at the end if you, you know, once you get the brown belt because you need to pass the exam, but they might just be like more focused on teaching you how to fight, you know? You might not learn like the classical things in the order you're supposed to learn them at, it, and you're, it's a bigger emphasis on just fighting, which is cool too, so you have to try it out to see what you like, uh, you know? And if you, if you like it, then there you go. That's your answer, right? At the end of the day, as long as you enjoy it, it's beneficial to you. You're learning an art. That's all that matters, man. All right, I hope that made sense and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. So thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and click on the notification bell. Also, there's a link down below. If you guys click on it, it's gonna bring you to a page where you could follow me on all my social media platforms and you can also apply for, uh, for coaching so that you guys can work directly with me. Also, one last thing guys, if you have any questions, right, send me an email. That's the best way to reach me. I read them and I'll, I'll answer your, your questions, man. All right, peace.